The attacker was identified by the Israeli military as an Egyptian border police officer, who entered Israeli territory through an emergency crossing in the border fence. The emergency crossing was designed to allow the Israeli army to access the Sinai Peninsula, where terrorist groups and smugglers operate. The Israeli military said it was cooperating with the Egyptian army to investigate the incident, which it called a terrorist attack. The Egyptian government claimed that the police officer was chasing drug smugglers across the border, and that an exchange of fire took place. The Israeli media reported that the attacker killed two Israeli soldiers at a military post near Mount Harif, in the Negev Desert, early on Saturday morning. Their bodies were discovered by their lieutenant a few hours later, when they did not answer their radio. A third soldier was killed in a shootout with the assailant, who was also killed by Israeli troops. A fourth soldier was slightly wounded. The incident was the first of its kind in more than a decade, since an Islamic State gunman crossed from Sinai into Israel and killed a police officer and members of a family. The three Israeli soldiers who died were Staff SGT. Ohad Danan, 20, Staff SGT. Ori Izhad Ilas, 19, and SGT. Liya Ben Nun, their funerals were held on Sunday afternoon.